We are leaving for our wedding trip in just three days. I cannot believe it. We're so excited and it's not just our wedding, which by itself is such an incredible thing, but we're also going to be staying there for one week. So it's like a vacation at the same time. And we're also having all of our friends and our family is going to be there too. So it's just like so many things that we're excited about. And it's in Ibiza, which is a place that Mo and I both really love. So my excitement level right now is very high. <laughs> so I thought I would vlog the next few days and just share how I'm getting ready for our trip, what I'm going to be packing, last minute like beauty things that I'm going to do, which definitely includes getting my nails done because they are so long. And I've actually been purposely waiting to do my nails just before we go so that, you know, they're all nice and fresh. And yeah, just share a few of the things that I'm going to be doing leading up to our trip. Everything is pretty much set for our wedding. The last few things we have to do is just approve the stationery so the fonts on the menus and the little name cards for the ceremony seating but apart from that everything else is done which has felt so good like the last few weeks I've really just been able to be excited for everything that's to come and all the people and like the whole event but of course I've been like stressed out too because I'm just hoping that everything goes well but it does feel really good to know that all of like the big things are done and we have pretty much every day planned out like we have different activities that we're gonna do our friends did tell us though that on one of the days before the wedding to not plan anything and now my friend just told me that I need to be ready at a certain time with certain clothes and all of that so they're planning a surprise for us which is just like oh so sweet. As a little pre-wedding gift, one of my friends gifted me all of these fresh green juices from Pure Delight and their soups. It actually came in a pack with more things. I've already eaten and drank a lot of these, but I thought this was such a nice gift idea for a bride-to-be or anyone who is like busy. And this is the pure veggie green juice. It's pretty similar to the one that I make myself. So thanks so much to Nadine for gifting me these. I love you. She knows how much I love green juice and this week I don't have to juice because she's gifted me these. So yay. I thought this was really really sweet on to some packing these are some of the dresses and outfits that i want to bring i've put them on this rack which i always find really helpful whenever we travel is to just see everything visually and for swimming suits and stuff i like to lay everything out on my bed so that i can see everything it just makes it a lot easier for me to plan and yeah just make sure that i have enough things for all of the activities and festivities. <laughs> One of the newer pieces, which I don't think I've showed you yet, is this beautiful dress from Zara. It's got this really nice kind of crochet lace detailing on it. And I think it's gonna be really nice. It's like a little summer dress. I really love the details on this. So I'm definitely going to bring that. This is the second dress that I found for our wedding day that I want to have as a backup in case I want to change out of my main wedding dress. But very happy that I finally found a dress that I really like. And then I'm also bringing this open knit sweater to layer on top if I get chilly. I really love this kind of design and just the very like casual laid back feeling of a sweater like this. I think this goes really well with a dress underneath and of course you can also wear it like with jeans and just like a normal outfit but definitely paired on top of a dress. I think it's very cute for like any chilly summer nights. I'm gonna bring that and this is from Max Mara weekend. I'll see if I can have this link for you guys down below. So yeah, I am going to get packing in a little bit. I've also already packed my bikinis, swimsuits, some cover-ups. I love these packing cubes. As you guys probably know, I get them on Amazon and they literally make traveling so much better because your stuff just stays in this little cube and it makes it a lot easier to pack and organize and just feel like, you know, a bit more together as you're traveling and things are not just like floating around in your bag. I just 
just got my nails done. They look so pretty. I went for a similar kind of whitey nude, a uh, little bit of pink in their shade, but this time it's a little bit more sheer. I don't know if you guys can see that, but we actually mixed two colors together to have it be a little bit more sheer and just a bit soft. I also got a pedicure in the same color, so I feel very like matchy matchy and very fresh. Also on beauty, I did get my brows done. Last week I got them threaded, so that feels nice as well. But I'm super happy with my nails, and I always ask for them to do my nails quite thin. So I do a very small layer of acrylic and then two coats of color, and I also have them not paint the sides of my nails which I have mentioned in another video and that just makes the nails look a little bit longer and I think it's just very flattering for the hand so yeah very very happy with my nails good morning guys it is the next day it's our last full day until we leave tomorrow so today this morning we went to do our PCR test although we're pretty sure we just need a negative antigen test which is the quick test but just to be extra extra sure we're getting the PCR test because we don't want any <laughs> issues tomorrow when we're traveling and we've been like extra careful the last few days that we don't get sick like of course we're always being careful to not get sick but it's been extra extra careful this week because that would just be like the worst thing like we've been planning this whole event and then yeah we definitely don't want to get sick right now and i'm about to do a workout i thought i would show you guys what i'm going to be doing i'll be following along a sammy clark igtv workout she does strength training with minimal weight so it's not like crazy equipment that's needed but i have a few different dumbbells that i just got off of amazon and they are really great like just very simple but i love how i feel after i do a workout like that and of course i love pilates and yoga as well but i do find that strength training with weight it's just really great for my body i notice really great muscle definition and just strength so yeah i'm gonna get started and i'll make sure to have the video that i do linked down below in the description box if you guys want to check it out i'm gonna do full body today It is now a little bit later and I am so happy. I went into the city to run some errands and one of the things I wanted to get was a pair of black heels because I actually don't own a pair of black sandals, which is kind of crazy. The ones that I have are closed, like the toe is closed. So I was thinking about getting my wedding shoes that I showed you guys in a few videos back in black but I called them, they didn't have them, and then I ended up going into the city and I found this style and it was on sale, which is so exciting because I think they are like perfect. I needed just like a simple black sandal that I could wear with dresses if we go out and I actually prefer these for that kind of occasion. Like they're just so easy and simple and I really love the square toe as well. I think that's like a really nice modern twist and the heel is also not too high which I love and they're just perfect. I'm so happy that I found these in my size and on sale. So that was a big win for today. I don't know the style name, but I'll make sure to have them linked down below for you guys. And then I also popped in 
to Zara. I was actually planning on trying to find black heels similar to this at Zara, but I didn't actually find any, but I did find these, and I think these are so fun. They are rope flat sandals in this really nice white creamy color. I think these are gonna go great with my summer dresses that I have, and I loved the color of them too. And then I also saw this gorgeous, gorgeous handbag. So I think this is gonna be a good kind of everyday, like summery kind of bag, especially for a vacation. I really loved the detail, and of course this gold chain, so pretty and the detailing is gorgeous and it's just nice to have a bag that I don't have to be like super super careful with in case you know something happens I get sand on it or it gets a stain or something it's okay so really really love this and then I was at Massimo Dutti and I found this scarf which I think is going to be a great like sarong scarf to wear with a white bikini or white swimming suit but also just to like have on your shoulders if it gets cold at night and here I am packing <laughs> some more stuff that I need to fold and put into these cubes. For dinner, I'm going to have this salad. I picked this up on the way back home. I really have not been in the mood to cook. I think it's because, you know, we're traveling and we're just busy. So I'm going to have this and then I'm also going to warm up this soup that I got from my friend Nadine. This is a parsley root soup. If you guys know about the place Dean and David, this is their avocado superfood salad, but without the bulgur. Instead, I got the quinoa and rice mix. It's got lettuce, tomatoes, grapes, beets, walnuts, avocado, of course, and the dressing is a rucola dressing. It is so good. I don't think I've been this anxious and nervous, but also excited ever in my entire life. It's really something very unique. <laughs> Again, it's just like the mix of everything that we have going on, like the wedding, the trip, our families, our friends. But yeah, today has been a very busy day it's been difficult to vlog because it's like we're doing small things in all different places and areas so it's like difficult to capture that in a vlog but i'm sure you guys can understand like how <laughs> we must feel right now but i've checked this in now i've done all of the documents and like we need a qr code to enter spain i've arranged for our transport for tomorrow to the airport and we're basically packed i've also been doing some work for our brand nourish 3 mostly for our social media we post every other day so we post four times per week and we also post stories on those days and because next week is going to be so busy we just wanted to get everything done and planned for next week so that it still stays consistent and we're really proud of our social media if you guys are not following us there yet definitely do i'll have a link for it down below if you guys want to learn about skin tips health tips wellness also speaking of skin i don't know what happened <laughs> but my skin cleared up in the last like two or three days the inflammation inflammation that I had on my skin and like the little bumps almost completely gone but I don't want to like jinx myself I think it's because I, I was really stressed before but now like the last few days I've been really looking forward to it of course I have my nerves you know for everything that's happening but I feel much better and I think you can really see it in my skin as well so I am so happy with that <laughs> anyway Mo and I are now going to chill out We've both just taken showers, washed the day off, and we're gonna sit on the couch and just enjoy. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure to check the description box down below for links for things that I mentioned. Thanks again so much for watching. I hope that you're all having a really nice day, and I will see you in my next one. Mwah. We're getting ready.